So we're here today with the Notorious Cuddle Bear Gang. How are you doing today? Chilling. Hey, how's it going? Pretty good. How's it going with yourself? You're doing okay. Do the ladies like to call you Bear God or Jobo? Spanish bitches call me El Sodio. What do we call you? Teddy Red, otherwise known as Cuddle King. Who started cuddling first? What you mean between like me and Jobo or you mean like baby Jesus? <laughs> Probably Ryan, because he's a slut. So, why cuddling? Why not? Because I can't last long in bed. Sucks. What What age did you start cuddling at? I was a late bloomer, so I was about 17 and a quarter. I mean, I've been doing this since I was, you know, sitting right next to the placenta, so. Who is the best cuddler? You know. Me. Max. Bear God. Who came up with the name Cuddle Bear Gang? We used to have a third member. His name was Chris B. Well, how exactly does one become a Cuddle Bear? Is there some sort of initiation? It's got a little bear like nigga. So for <clears throat> all the viewers at home, we're all wondering, yeah. are there any rules to the cuddle? No penetration. That's it. What happens if you were to break those rules? Nah, that's completely forbidden. I ain't never did that. We don't allow that shit over here. Tell us, Daddy. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe later. Uh, mm -hmm. Take these fruit snacks. Go ahead, get out of there. Good. Exactly how many times a day do you get your cuddle on? And is there such thing as too much cuddling? Never. Never. Can you tell us why there's no girls in the Cuddle Bear Gang? <laughs> Next. 